and Moon probably on 50-ish, 58 food. So um, obviously significantly less, and I imagine Moon's going here to buy a Sapper, and I'm um, going to try and take out this expansion again, but uh, he may just uh, buy a Zeppelin, I don't know, Moon does love abusing Zeppelins, and um, Nicker being forced to run in, uh, he doesn't have a TP, I don't think. Uh, no, he doesn't have a TP, so... Um, Moon doesn't actually buy a sapper in the end. He just it looks like he's just running in. He is um he does have a tech advantage, but obviously a serious serious food disadvantage. And I think that's um going to be really bad for him. Obviously um, uh, M Moon uh, with a uh, metamorphosis is still on cooldown here, so uh, he won't be able to use it for a while. Level five priestess of the Moon, uh, fairly well protected by this uh, ogre mauler. It's going to mean that. Um, Moon can't really focus him down. Level 7 now on the Demon Hunter, but um, slowed still, so uh, still not able to do too much damage. Uh, this Goblin Zeppelin actually being repaired by a Wisp as well, but I'm not sure if Moon's actually going to be able to do anything useful with it at this point, uh, because of um, the intense focusing power. Uh, Nicker could just take out the Zeppelin, and Moon has forced a TP away with only, I think, like three or four bears. Um, yeah, four bears. And, um,. Uh, he does actually manage to save a couple on low hit points, but Nicker just has such an army. Uh, 43 food versus 71, and um, this is really going uh, very well for Nicker. I think um, Moon's just a bit sort of stunned at having lost to a mass ride, such an, or a pretty unconventional strategy. And um, Nicker finally getting some more um, tech upgrades, and um, actually a lot more drives as well. And uh, I guess he's going to be pushing all the way up to 80 food again, and then he'll probably want to just... Um, start an attack because he does uh, there's no reason to prolong this anymore really Moon with a couple dryads now I guess he just wants to just uh, get rid of that slow stuff like that and um, so it's worth having a couple dryads around Moon actually catching one up, um, one dryad out and um, coming in but uh, Moon's ar entire army getting caught a little bit out here Moon does lose a dryad as well and um, Moon's uh, or a mass of range units now coming in. Moon does now have metamorphosis, so um, we'll be able to do a lot of damage here. But I don't think it's going to be enough at this point. Moon, I'm um, having a um, pretty nice position with his bears, where he manages to get them around the around the edge. But um, still, I think uh, Nicker can. Nicker just has enough units that the positioning doesn't really make a difference. And Moon brings in a lot of wisps as well, probably just to try and um, block off some units and. Uh, get buy him some time but I don't think uh, it's actually going to do that much and another uh, bear is about to go down and actually a second bear is going to go down as well in a second and this is going to be GG in a second now I imagine because um, even though Moon is sort of um, still picking off units uh, Nicker uh, really does have a large advantage and I guess um, Moon just doesn't sort of want this game to end he thinks he can um, win it just with his level 6 demon hunter what he doesn't realize actually is that um, Nicker has uh, what seven experience off a of level six priestess of the moon, and um, when that happens, Nicker can just run into Moon's base with a large army and um, to cast um, Starfall, and then uh, as that, and then if Moon wants to come in and try and kill the priestess of the moon, um, Nicker's huge army can sort of beat him down, and so um, really uh, that would be sort of um, the best way for uh, Nicker to for force a fight. He just needs to get I think one more kill, unless he actually got one. I'm not sure. Um, I don't actually see what happened to his Priestess of the Moon, but um, now um, two one upgrades on the uh, Dryads, and I think probably still zero one upgrades on the Bears, I and mean, we can't be um, getting more dry, more um, upgrades now. Um, level five and yeah, really so close to six on this Priestess of the Moon, and um, Moon getting caught out a bit. And when this Dryad dies, Moon uh, Nicker will get uh, Starfall. But level eight on the um, Demon Hunter, it's not going to be that useful, unfortunately, because all he's going to be getting now is Immolation, and Moon does say GG. So um, okay, so it's. Uh, we just have one match left, which is the ace match, which um, has to be played, and um, I'm not sure who that's going to be played against or played between yet. But um, I'll, I'll see you in a minute with uh, whoever it is. Okay, and we're back with um, the ace match now, which is going to be t between Nicker and um, Soccer, actually. So um, obviously another Elf Mirror match, and I don't think I'm ever going to want to do one of these games again. But um, uh, this is obviously um, obviously We Made Foxes actually won it um, for. Uh, is actually winning 4-2 at the moment, so um, even if uh, Gab wins this, then they still don't win overall. But um, since this is the early rounds, uh, every point counts, and so uh, th there's still a lot of motivation for both sides to win it um, right now. And um, Nick are going for a uh, Priestess of the Moon first, and um, uh, Soccer going for a uh, Demon Hunter first. So I'm um, pretty standard stuff from both sides. And ooh, a bit of lag. Okay, um, we're back. And um, Soccer now uh, tanking a bit of damage. Uh, on his uh, Ancient of War, bringing in his uh, Demon Hunter as soon as possible, and 
I'm not sure. I don't think um, Soccer will have actually seen um, Moon's game because this was played immediately afterwards. And so um, maybe Moon's told him about uh, how Nicker plays Priestess of the Moon. Maybe not. But actually, um, 100 saw one Ancient of War looking pretty similar. Um, Nicker with a Wisp here, so he maybe he's going to try and put up an expansion later there and then walk it in a bit later. Um, and meanwhile, um, Moon obviously with um, very close to level two now. He'll just go and creep out one of the uh, one of the creeps and then get uh, his level two. And um, Nicker actually running about with his priestess of the moon a bit. I'm not sure where he's planning on going with this. And um, obviously this is gonna give um, Soccer his level two. And then he's actually gonna creep at all, I guess. And uh, Soccer now uh, started his tech. I'm not sure. I doubt. Um, yeah, Nicker is going for one ancient of war um, huntress build. So I guess uh, he is now starting his tech. Yeah. Um, and uh, Nick, uh, Nick are actually doing some fairly good wisp use. He has them in sort of quite interesting um, g or quite good tactical positions just for scouting. And um, it's going to be pretty hard for uh, soccer to play uh, sneakily with uh, this kind of um, wisp positioning. Uh, I think it's actually considerably better than um, soccer's wisp positioning. But a uh, very nice base build for here for soccer. Obviously, he's just going to put a change of war here, and that's going to leave lots of room for running about. And um, soccer has now scattered this uh, priestess of the moon. Obviously, again, now I'm going uh, arrow. Uh, uh, arrows first rather than um, searing arrows first rather than aura which I, I guess is uh, just because he is um, because he's uh, attacking with it rather than um, going all out aggressive the uh, arrows make a bit more sense uh, and as as they did last game with um, moon versus snicker and um, obviously this is a secret valley so there's uh, two heal fountains as well so um a hunter's build is generally quite good, but it looks like Nicker's actually a bit late with his uh, moon wells, and so he doesn't actually have sufficient food to build any um, units at this point. And um, this moon will go up, and Nicker will have to repair it. Uh, actually, he probably won't have to repair it for a while, but he comes in to repair it anyways. Just always best to do it a bit early. And um, Nicker actually scouting this wisp with his wisp, and um, Soccer just uh, being forced to uh, detonate it. He does get the detonation though, and that um, it doesn't actually hit uh, the pieces of the moon though, so it's not the end of the world. And um, Moon does, or uh, sorry, Soccer does just run away, and Nicker puts up another moon well here. Um, and um, uh, Soccer now going and buying boots of speed. Uh, uh, he does have a dust as well, although he must have realized by now that there's not actually many hunters coming out, and a hunters hall going out for Soccer as well. So he's going to be going for a similar strategy as Moon went, I imagine. Um, Unless uh, Nicker changes something up, which is very possible, and Soccer with a wisp in the back of um, Nicker's base does it does get killed. It doesn't. Um, Soccer doesn't have time to cancel it, and um, Ancient of Wonders going up here for Nicker as well. It's a bit, it's a really odd position actually. I'm wondering if he's um, worried about it being cancelled, maybe. And uh, Pieces of the Moon taking a bit of damage from the couple archers Soccer has built, but you'll notice Soccer hasn't built as many archers as um, Moon did because um, Soccer um, scouted this tech a lot earlier, and so he's not a lot less worried about a, um, a Huntress push. And uh, Nicker does have two Huntresses out at this point, but that's not going to be um, a huge um, threat to. Uh, soccer, especially with all the moon wells, and um, first ancient of war going up, or ancient of lore, sorry, going up for soccer, and I imagine a second one will go up um, fairly shortly. And um, soccer rebuilding a couple of wisps just because he did lose a couple earlier. And um, Nicker actually um, still at the healing fountain, he's healed up perfectly fine, um, but um, not uh, clearly not enough. And um, two ancient of winds actually going down for um, uh, for Nicker, so that's pretty uh, sneaky of him building that hunter's hole. Um, soccer d did scout it immediately though, so that's very nice for him. But obviously. Um, Going an uh, ancient of wind build after having built a hundred all was a bit wasteful, but it's mainly just quite sneaky. And I'm um, actually with this ancient of wonders here. I um, I think um, Nicker might try to be trying to do something pretty sneaky here, uh, just because uh, you don't generally hide your ancient of wonders like that. Um, Sakura has picked up a uh, Naga of second, and I haven't seen a second hero for um, pieces uh, for. Um, Nicker, but uh, as I said before, uh, there's a couple of viable candidates. Obviously Naga, obviously. Um, uh, the Dark Ranger or, or Demon Hunter, even you could probably go second. It'd be quite nice to go as a tank, especially considering the uh, Priestess of the Moon is quite low level as well. Um, and uh, these uh, couple Huntresses being brought in just to get a bit of a block on. Uh, three Huntresses now out for um, Nicker, and I think that, that that was just enough to sort of slow him down a bit. And um, Tucker with dust, so Nicker can't just hide. He does have to run, and uh, getting mana burnt again. And um, Soccer can mana burn him even once more if he wants. And um, meanwhile, um, no units being produced for Nicker here. Despite having 700 gold and sufficient food, you really should get on top of that because otherwise Soccer just could be on top of him really quickly. And um, Soccer has a couple hunters built, or at least one hunters built himself. But um, 
now just producing uh, dryads from one ancient of lore. Um, so this is the second one, second ancient of lore now going up in a weird position. Actually, you think he'd put it at the back of his base, but maybe he wants to um, have it for a bit of aggression. And this first dryad is now out, and uh, combined with uh, the naga, it should be able to take out this uh, huntress. But um, Ancient of Wonders going now for soccer as well now, and um, finally um, Nicker's producing. Actually, pro go Nicker's going for mass fairy dragons. A very interesting strategy. You see it very rarely, but it works quite well against um, what soccer's doing now. Because as you can see, um, soccer producing only um, sort of light armor units. Really, he, uh, he had a couple huntresses out. He's producing dryads now, and um, no tier three, so no bears for a while. And um, it's a really uh, interesting strategy. You don't see it very often at all. Picking up a dark ranger second and um, that's obviously going to provide a, lot, a bit of meat, and obviously the great thing about uh, mass fairy dragons is that the obvious counter for an elf would be to go um, to build a couple extra archers, uh, but uh, with these huntresses out, that's going to make it quite hard for um, Nicker to uh, actually, or for Soccer to um, count, uh, just um, spam archers, because obviously the huntresses are just so good against archers, and um, I'm not sure if Nicker is hiding his fairy dragon somewhere. Yeah, he's hiding.